Hey, your keys are in your door. Bitch. You're going you to jail, bud. Oh, right. Yeah, you I'm are. Too fucking old for that. Get out of here. Yeah. Really? All day, every day. Welcome to the channel, baby. Welcome to the channel, Cubes in Texas. Going in red. All day, every day. Get paid. Texas tatted on my own. You got used to know. Let me warm these tires up real quick. What it do is your boy Juice coming at you with another video and drip drop, drippity drop drop. Look like it's about to start raining. I already knew this before I took off. We're, I don't give a fuck. Man, oh man, I got something to tell you guys. Holy shit. Another one bites the dust. But this one is extremely different this time. You have never seen this one before. Ever. You know why? Because nobody does this. Alright? What is the Kawasaki H2 supercharged motorcycle to you? Is it a play toy? Is it a stump bike? Is it a fucking drag bike? Well, apparently, it's a bike to do whatever the fuck you want to do on. But, uh... So, bike nights are every Wednesday over here in Houston, right? When guys are, uh, they go out to bike night, man, it's one of them times where you can, you can show out a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Showcase the skills that you do have, showcase the bikes that you do have, and everything like that, right? So, one guy decided that, hey, man, <laughs> I'm a 12 o'clock, my motherfucking age too. In the arms of the angel, fly away from here. Oh no! Woo! I'm at twelve o'clock by age two. o'clock by H2. No, your fucking H2 is not a fucking stump bike, bro. So, yeah, I went ahead and saved the video for you guys. I know y'all would want to see it because I know nobody would believe me if they didn't see it. And I wanted to hop on this story early because I've been thinking about it all fucking night. Not because I know the guy, because simply if I get an H2 or when I get an H2 or if I even want one, what would make me do this? You know what it was? I looked at the video several times, about 10 times to be exact, and there's a man, two up on the bike next to him with his girl on the bike. Now, a lot of times I've had this, not this issue, but I've had this happen to me before. I see somebody else with a bad bitch on their bike. You really can't tell what she looks like. But, and so you try to impress her doing some, some rinky dink shit. And that's exactly what that looked like. But what really killed me is the lie he told afterwards. You all right? I'm good, dog. Oh, fuck. You good? Nah, I'm good. You good, bro? Yeah. I thought you knew how to wheelie, bro. Watch the back. Nah, nah, I'm good, dog. I came to fix my glove, dog. I took that, my shit off the fucking bridle, man. I put that bitch in first. Bitch came right up, dog. Oh man. oh man, oh man, I wouldn't have had said shit about it if he wouldn't, if he wouldn't have lied like that. Nothing, I wouldn't have said a damn thing about it. But that goes to show, guys, that there's people out there that's riding these motorcycles that can't take responsibility for your action. I respect somebody way more if you were just to say, hey man. I thought Uncle Willie, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. This bike is way too powerful for me to be 12 o'clock in that bitch like that. And you know what? We'd have been like, okay, that's what we seen. You know what I'm saying? But don't lie to us like your glove got stuck. Motherfucker, what kind of gloves are you wearing on a $25,000 motorcycle? 
them that they getting stuck. That sound like some bullshit to me. If I ain't never heard none. But hey man, as you can see, I'm in this motherfucking rain doing the thing, doing the thing. I hope my GoPro don't break the game. Hold up. But yeah guys, I need what would make you go out there at 12 o'clock on fucking H2 Hummer? Huh? What would make you? I'm not screaming at you, but I just want to know. Why the fuck would anybody do that? I mean, why the fuck? What? I am so mad right now. So fucking mad. So goddamn mad. And it ain't even my bike. You say it's okay, it's fixable. It's not the point. It's the fact that, man, you gotta respect these motorcycles, man. That bike was not built to be stunting like that. There's so many motherfuckers who got H2s, like uh, Jason Britton. That's one. Um, you don't see him out there trying to 12 o'clock that bitch. And he is one of the best stunt riders I've ever seen in my life on YouTube and shit like that. But he ain't trying to 12 o'clock this shit. What makes you think that you about to go out there and do a balance point wheelie on a supercharged motorcycle with a fucking thousand cc engine? Holy shit. What has this fucking world come to, man? Motherfuckers say bike nice lit. Nah, it's fucking dangerous right now. It's fucking dangerous. So dangerous that I'm about to lane split so I can get to the crib. I hope you guys understand. I'm sorry. 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 It just rained a little bit. I hope they understand that I'm not about to waiting in this motherfucking line right now but I'm gonna take off like a oh man it's coming down coming down coming down I would try to do a wheelie in the rain but I don't know I'm gonna feel like this might end well. No, that's not going to end well. So guys, I just wanted to run that by you because this is not an everyday thing. Alright? Basically, this guy had the motherfucking audacity to try to do a wheelie. I mean, all you got to do is get that bitch just a little bit of fucking throttle and I'm sure that front end will come up and get loose. Why you try to do it on the on-ramp and the on-ramp looks like it almost had a curve coming. Bro, I know you're watching this video right now. I know you're watching it and I know you're going to dislike it. But I got to say it, bro. I have to say it. You ain't shit. You ain't shit for that. Bro, you ooh from Kawasaki owners across the world. You ain't shit, man. And if I see you at bike night, it's whatever you wanna do. You know what I'm saying? I got no I got no leash on me. I got no motherfucking leash, bro. Like I am ruthless, I am so goddamn reckless. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> you is tripping my dude. That bike is ruined, man. It ain't no good, man. Throw that bitch in the trash now. Ooh wee!
Hey, he tried to wheelie, bro. I know. I thought you knew how to wheel it, bro. Watch the back. Nah, nah, I'm good, dog. I came to fix my glove, dog. I took my, my shit off the fucking bridle, man. I put that bitch in first. My bitch came right up, dog. Uh, you good? You need to go to hospital? Nah, I'm good, dog. You sure, bro? Yeah, you gonna make sure your house is leaking. Huh? It's leaking in the back door. Yeah, we're gonna it off. It broke. Nah, the, it off. The, shit, the shit broke. Huh? The handlebar broke. Oh, his handlebar broke? Yeah. yeah.